we got a new intro. Well, it's not like brand new, but it's like updated. You guys ready for it? All right, Jimmy, roll it. What's going on guys, Daniel AK Phoenix CTS coming at you guys with another brand new episode of Filmmaker Reacts, a weekly show where I react to a film trailer or music video from a filmmaking standpoint to help you guys understand what goes into making your favorite videos on the internet. BTS is back with a full song, like they got actual singles dropping. They were going very American with this album release. First we had Shadow, that was the last one, and that was just Sugar, and now we got the whole band and Black Swan, a very interesting title for the song. I've listened to the song, I haven't watched the art film. It's very like dark and dreary, and really gives you, at least it gives me a lot of fake love vibes, that's how I describe it, just like in terms of like the bass and the trap beat and also just like the tone and mood of the lyrics. And you might be wondering like, fake love, like that's your favorite song of theirs, Daniel, so like, are you loving this song? Well, right now I'm like, intrigued by it because it doesn't hit as hard as fake love you know fake love is still like a bop but this one is more mellow and just chilling out and uh, much like shadow like i was like kind of not too crazy for it at first because i was like you can't really jam out to this a lot it's like one of those mood pieces but over time i'm i'm growing shadow is growing on me so i anticipate this one to grow on me as well but without further ado we've been talking about the song way too much let's watch the actual art film and break it down from a filmmaking standpoint all right, here we go. Big hits. Entertainment. Subtitles on, of course, because that's how we roll up in here on the Phoenix DTS channel. A dancer dies twice. One when they stop dancing. And this first death is more painful. That's like kind of dark. They stop dancing. That's more painful. So you gotta like go through this hardship first in order to get like a quick and easier death later on. That's a very wide, starting off wide. And I like the reflections, some water. Water makes things more cinematic um, and like reflections. So um, this could have been a dry set to make it a little bit more like hyped up. They could have just like sprayed a hose all over the floor just to add those reflections. We have seven dancers. That's no coincidence, I bet. Okay. So that could have been just a digital zoom in where like this, it's all like this, and then they just zoom in the actual footage, or they might have another camera that's more zoomed in. Uh, this one definitely seems like it's another camera angle, just super, super wide. And this warehouse or abandoned mall complex, it looks like, looks pretty real and authentic. Um, if it wasn't, I'd say that this, just this part right here is real, and then all the rest is CGI, but I wouldn't put it past them to make it real. Love the Jimin intro. Uh, Jimin said in the Boy With Love Making Of, like whenever a song starts with Jimin, it's gonna be a great song, and I stand by that. So I like this in the foreground right here. It looks like we're spying on the dance from afar. <laughs> Skylight. This is this is only one light source by the look of it. You know, it's just the thing up in the sky, the skylight, and that's it. Whoa, this dude's flexible. Hell no. Now we got actual light. So now we actually get into there, and now we got the guy with the steady cam moving in. He's in there with the action with them. Before it was just a bunch of static shots from afar. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, yeah. Me now, me now. Do you me 
It's like you're trying to break free from a cage, but like they're not letting him. That's what I'm getting from it. Um, also want to note that there's a lot of like processing on all the vocals and everything. So like I, I tried to like figure out who's singing who. Um, so if you guys know any reliable vocal uh, lyric videos, please send them my way. Not just like uh, Gay Gucci or whoever the first person is that sends them out because they're not accurate. And I know that they're just doing it just to put it out as fast as possible to get those views. I don't blame them. I do that thing sometimes too. And I'm not as in depth, but just like, I'd like a authentic, like actual breakdown of the lyrics to know who's singing when. I know there's doubling up a lot of the time, but those other lyric videos aren't that reliable. So if you guys got good videos, send them my way, please. He's like, Floating amongst them. Crazy. I'm also seeing now a lot of fo like fog in here. So they probably just pumped in a bunch of fog from a fog machine just to make it look more dramatic because then the light reflects off the fog a little bit, creates more atmosphere. <laughs> Cage is gone. I I I can see Jimin doing this kind of dance stuff. Like, it's right up his alley. Those strings are very horrifying and unnerving. Now the steps are really filling the soundscape. I don't know where the other dancers went. So we're using a lot of like telephoto lenses so you could tell because of how compressed it is. Like the stairs look like they're pretty right behind him. Not like if it was wide, you'd see the depth and like all like, yeah, the depth between him and the stairs and like the pillars and the wall. But this looks like really compressed. So it's like long telephoto lenses. So it like really looks like we're spying on them from afar because we got this like telephoto lens looking. This is more wider up close. This is a wider lens because you can see how far back the stairs look compared to him as opposed to a shot a couple times. Oh, I know that was a move. That was like a move from martial arts. So. This lens in particular is extremely wide. I'm gonna guess like a 10 to 18-ish. up to or is it just gonna fade out it's just gonna fade out all right it's very interesting to see that they accomplished that with just like a very minimal light source setup I know they had like those light the light cage which was a very interesting thing I don't know if those were actual lights or if they made it like laser beams and posts or whatever but 
Um, a very cool executed video. It was very simple execution. You know, a lot of it was just we're looking at it from afar and they had probably I'm gonna guess like only a couple takes of them going through with the steady cam up close because they didn't use that footage a lot. So I'm guessing that wasn't a main focus of what they were trying to make in the film. Um, but it goes along with the song pretty well. Like I said, I'm just gonna keep listening to this and it's gonna grow on me, grow on me more. They've painted a very interesting picture so far with the the songs that they released and you know the album itself uh, with Shadow and Black Swan. Like I said, it's easy to call it dark at first, but I like to consider it more raw and like, you know, just emotionally resonant, you know, kind of like what a rated R movie would be, like one of those Oscar Beatty dramas. It's not dark, it just shows you a real side of life that kind of sucks sometimes. That's what they're kind of showing here. I don't know if it's the mood is gonna flip with Ego when they release that uh, J-Hope song, I'm guessing. I think that's the next one. Um, so maybe like we're gonna see like a transition through the album of like this darkness to lighter tones or something or like more of just like a revelation. I don't know. I don't even know how many songs are gonna be on this album. Um, it kind of sucks that they're showing us so much, you know, by the time the album drops we would have known four songs already and then by then like are there only gonna be like six more? Like that's kind of, eh, but whatever, you know? Anyways guys, I hope you guys enjoyed learned something new if you did enjoy I ask you please drop a like and subscribe really helps me out and 2020 go get it man We're almost a month in which blows my mind So go chase your dreams go do whatever you need to do and don't forget to find yourself be yourself and love yourself Hi guys, Daniel aka Phoenix here checking in with you guys at the end of the video If you did enjoy what you saw, please check out one of these other two videos or just like the video and subscribe down below for a video every single week. Thank you guys. I love you. Have a good one.